In game one of this home and away series, Arias won by 19. So in order to advance, Strasbourg would not only need to win game two, but win by at least 20 points. So let's find out if they did. Strasbourg opened a big lead early when they run an Iverson cut into an inside pick and roll. Eric Murphy pops to the open corner and drops in a good look at a three ball. Irving Walker gives us a demonstration on how to split the pick and roll. Watch how far in front he throws his dribble. He recovers it and rises up for the open jumper and the friendly roll. Even though Strasbourg was up by 8, they were really down 11 in the aggregate. Watch this terrible attempt to switch. No communication by the defense leaves Inchilikina wide open. And he's a player we all expect to make a splash in the NBA someday soon. Aris finally went to work running a nice horn set, getting a pick and roll into a flare screen. This flows right into a dribble handoff to the corner, but wait, Yankovic sets his man up perfectly for the back door. The perfect bounce pass leads to a slam dunk. Still struggling to score, Aris almost throws the inbounds pass away, but watch how the deep penetration collapses the defense. Jaite never moves to box out his man, and Justin Jackson throws the rebound back through the hoop. Strasbourg was taking this seriously with their hustle. On this bad decision to get up in the air to throw a cross-court pass, Aris had a surefire steal, but Leloup gets a hand on it, and watch Paul Lecom lay himself out to save this ball. Wow! It goes right to Walker, who finds Jate for the little jump hook. This certainly deserves praise from the coach. Late in the third, with the aggregate score almost even, Strasbourg comes down looking to get their lead to 20. A little pin down the lane was supposed to be a switch for the defense, but Cyrellis is way late and Strasbourg has the overall lead for the first time. However, Aris is able to stem the tie with a last second contested three that actually banks in off the backboard and these teams are tied overall. Later in the fourth, Strasbourg is clinging to a 21 point lead when Aris comes down on the break and gets an incredible and one softly off the glass. And midway in the fourth, Strasbourg gets an isolation out top by AJ Slaughter, who nails the tough three ball to get them back in the lead. And in the end, Strasbourg gets another clutch three to cut the aggregate score to only two points, but this was the last basket they could make, as RS scored the last six points of the game to take this series and move on in the playoffs. Stay tuned next week as we'll break down even more highlights from some of the most exciting basketball Europe has to offer, the Basketball Champions League.